Welcome to the FX Options Weekly Outlook, a weekly podcast series hosted by Jason Ayers, a top instructor, trader, and founder of Optionsource.net. Join Jason as he discusses the latest trends in the Forex market with a look ahead on the U.S. dollar versus the major currencies using the most commonly used technical indicators. Well, hi there, and welcome to the ISC FX Options Weekly Outlook for July 30th, 2012. As always, this is Jason Ayers of Optionsource.net. Let's start off with a look at a weekly chart of the U.S. dollar index. This is a great way to gain perspective as to how the U.S. dollar has been trading against a basket of currencies. Well, the U.S. dollar lost considerable ground on the heels of the European Central Bank's promise to protect the euro. While the move was quick to the downside, 82 and a half uh, held as support. And we expect to bounce this week to perhaps retest this 83.84 focal zone. Let's take a quick look at the daily chart. The daily chart reflects the multi-day sell-off for the U.S. dollar last week and the importance of 82.5 as support. If 82.5 fails to hold, the next major support level lies down at the 81.81.5 focal zone. Let's take a look at the CDD, the U.S. versus the Canadian dollar. Well, as we can see here, the CDD lost considerable ground last week, now testing deeper into the 100-101 support level. We suspect a bounce this week that is likely to find resistance at the 102-103 focal zone. Let's take a look at the YUK, the U.S. versus the Japanese yen. Well, the YUK continues to consolidate within the 78, 78 and a half support level. As long as the pair remains above 78, we are open to a move towards the 79, 79 and a half resistance level. Next up, the U.S. dollar versus the euro as seen here in the ISE FX pair value EUI, the EUI took a significant dip once again on the headlines out of Europe and we expect support to hold at 80.81 this week. A bounce opens the window for a retest of the 82.83 resistance level. Let's take a look at the BPX, the U.S. dollar versus the British pound. Well, the BPX dropped below 63.5 last week. The 63.5-64 level now assumes the role of resistance. Failure to break back above 63.5 opens the window for a continuation lower and the test of 62.5-63. A break above 64 will confirm a continuation higher. Let's take a look at the AUX, the U.S. dollar versus the Australian dollar. Well, the AUX is testing deeper within the 95.96 support level. We expect this level to hold as support, uh, which lends credibility to a test of this 97.98 focal zone. A break below 95 opens the window for a tradable move lower. Let's take a look at a few of our key points. First of all, the U.S. dollar index failed to break and hold above 84 last week. Last week's headlines out of Europe accelerated a retest of support down at 82.5. We expect to bounce higher this week after such a significant drop. The CDD continued lower into the 100-101 support as European headlines once again forced the U.S. dollar lower against most major currencies. 100 is an important support and we expect to bounce this week. The YUK continues to test support at 78, 78.5. This level is a solid support, and we anticipate a bounce. However, a break and close below 78 opens the window for a move lower. The EUI lost considerable ground last week, once again, as a result of headlines out of Europe uh, that, that they were going to do what it takes to support the euro. 81 is a solid support, and after such a considerable drop, we expect a bounce this week. BPX closed below 63.5, 63.5-64 assumes the role of resistance as long as the pair remains below 63.5, the window is open for a continuation lower. And finally, the AUX slipped lower towards a test of 95. As long as the pair remains within 95, 96 focal zone, we are open to a bounce higher. And this has been your ISC FX Options Weekly Outlook for July 30th, 2012. As always, this is Jason Ayers of Optionsource.net reminding you to visit www.optionsource.net to sign up for your free webinar this week. Thank you for participating in this week's session. Please join us again next week. For trading ideas, exchange rates, webinars, news, and commentary, visit www.fxoptions.com. Become an Optionsource.net member. Visit www.optionsource.net. ISE FX Options can be easily traded through all options-enabled brokerage accounts. These exchange-listed securities are cash-settled in U.S. dollars and have a European-style exercise.